It's a Friday night. Hello there, seemingly German TLH. How goes it? Alone in the dark. Gloucester, Massachusetts, October 30th, 2001. 2100 hours. Hello there. I'm enjoying the cold and dark weather, I guess. Condi, this is Fisk. I hope you had a safe trip. I can already hear you ranting, but I've taken on a new case. I know, I know, I promised I'd quit, but I was contacted by a man named Johnson to go to Shadow Island and investigate Obed Morton and the Apcanis writing tablet. Does that ring any bells? Now you understand why I couldn't say no and had to leave right away. I'm going tomorrow. I left some notes on the office desk. See you soon, Carmi. Oh, I nearly forgot. If you want to contact Johnson, is it 555-1495? Boston Police Department. Name, Fisk. First name, Charles. Date of birth, February 17th, 1944. Presumed date of death, October 24th, 2001. Somewhere in the United States, October 31st, 2001, 1800 hours, 43 minutes. So? They'll be on Shadow Island in about an hour. Carnby's a loose cannon, but we had no real choice. Then the professor. Professor Eileen Sedrak is convinced that Obed Morton is her... We had no trouble persuading her. I must have those tablets in their translation. Is that clear, Johnson? Perfectly, sir. Daddy? Did I influence some Carnby action? Daddy! Is Cedric? Uh, Aline? Wake up. What? Oh, sorry. Excuse me. Here. You'll probably need this. Do you have your radio? Yes, I have it. Aline, when we get to the island, for your safety, you'd better stay close to me. My safety? Is there any danger? I was hired to authenticate the translation of the Abcanis stones. I will be working with Professor Hello Morton. there, chameleon. Can't sleep? My best friend died because of those tablets. He was killed on Shadow Island. And I swear I'm gonna find whoever did it. I'm very sorry. Listen. I know Professor Morton's reputation. He's a scientist, a great researcher. Well, to me, he's just another suspect. We're getting close. Shadow Island. What was that? Oh, the creature that attacks the plane isn't really clearly shown, aside from that one shot atop of the plane, so it's hard to guess. Of course, it would make the most sense for it to have wings. the 
dark. out of here I landed on some kind of old manor everything's dark I'm really scared you could Listen, say she's alone flashlight on so I can spot you in the dark okay worked fine I can see you What do I do now? Well, you've got to get inside the manor. There has to be a, a window or something. Find a safe place to hide and wait for me. But... I'll be there soon. Her sarcastic remarks, you mean? Carnby? Oh, the constant endgame flirting. Are you? I do not recognize the sound of your steps. Please help me. I've had an accident. You should never have come here, young lady. This is not a place for you or anyone else. Why? What's going on here? My son Obed is in danger, young lady. Obed? You mean Professor Obed Morton? The creatures of darkness. You must help him. You must take Obed with you before it's too late. Wait, what creatures? The creatures of darkness? What is... You see, young lady, here on Shadow Island, the shadows are alive. <laughs> they come and lick your face like hellfire. The shadows are cold and sharp and like razor blades. The shadows stalk you. They feed off your breath and your heat, but mainly off of your fear. Light dispels the shadows, but light also reveals the shadows. Obed will explain this better than I can. Where is he? How would I know? I haven't seen him for three days now. The last time he came, he entrusted me with this key. A statue in the smoking room. Take it. I don't hear anything. Then hush! Howard? Howard? Is that you? Howard? Oh, what in heaven's name are you doing? Who's Howard? <laughs> it's me, it's me, it's <laughs> Obed's father. Howard? Young lady, please go have a look in the corridor. There might be a problem. Howard? Is that you? More like Howard, her husband. If they are boneless, 
What are they made out of? to fight the creatures of darkness. This carpet can't hurt you, in a, even if you try. Carnby? Hello there. Cats want in. Young lady, there, on the table. Take it. What is it? Blood. An American Indian charm that will protect your life force. But why? How? And be careful, young lady. Hope it's not Carnby's blood. Question is, who would sleep in such position? Her head is not even on the pillow, it's against the wall. All that comfortable? Against uh, the wooden wall? Sounds like neck pain to me, possibly also back pain too. I guess it's the least of her problems right now though. Are difficulty sleeping? to her husband. Howard! Anything more specific? She also talked about a statue in one of the rooms of the manor. A smoking room, I think. I'd rather you stay put where you are until I come to get you. No way! I'm not staying here. I won't stay here with her. As you wish. Exactly. Good evening, Mixo.
Nobody should replace the light bulbs here. All these monsters. I'm sure there's a key somewhere. Use your flashlight. You should have left me a weapon. Remember my telling you you had no inkling of the dangers to expect? Well, you should have told me twice. This dialogue is a little bit uh, sequence breaking. to what she's gonna say now. Carnby, this is no island. This is a nightmare. What have you dragged me into? First of all, I never dragged you into anything. Secondly, I told you to remain put. And third, I don't have any idea either. Where is all this coming from? Did we step into the Twilight Zone or what? I'm telling you, I have no idea. Anyhow, if you hear someone calling for help, beware. I don't understand. You'll understand way too soon. The calling for help thing hasn't really occurred on uh, Combi's side at all. Aside from maybe when he meets Eden Shaw and hears the scream. So it's likely just more caught content at that point. And having excuses for absolutely everything is a very human nature. can clip through her. Which means that either she's really small or this charm is gigantic. Probably yes. Cats are really angry. So much that the screen is shaking. Carnby? Carnby, where can I find some catnip? Hey you, little cat, did you just ignore my flashlight? Hello? What a perv.
Question is, why wouldn't you? Well, I guess she does deserve... A little bit of med packs after the fall. Having such gigantic staircase is a waste of space. I want you to answer me. I swear, I heard something. Quit stalling. Did you talk about our research to this Mr. Lamb, yes or no? Well, how do you think I was able to find all those guinea pigs for you? That's your problem. Oh, no. It's not my problem. It's our problem. Listen carefully, Obed. I've been putting up with your whining and your cowardice for years, but it's over now. You've known my goals from the beginning, and nobody, especially not me, forced you into following me. So if I were to find out that you betrayed me, well, you know me, and you know I would not hesitate for a second. Oh yes, I know you. I know you are completely mad. It's you! It's you who... Yes, it's me. And so what? Never cross me again. Ever. You stick to your narcotic stupor and let me fulfill our destiny. Arnby, my legs are clipping through the floor. Also, hello there. Carnby. I just overheard a discussion that might be of interest to us. Two men, one of whom was Obed, were arguing about someone called Lamb. Does that name ring a bell? First of all, it confirms that Obed Morton is on the island. Secondly, we know he's alive. And third, I've already heard that name, or read it. But for the time being, I can't remember where or when. Well, I'm impressed by your powers of analysis. Is that how one becomes a private detective? Yeah? Keep your sarcasm on ice. You can dish it out once we've made it out of here. Anyhow, I'm warning you. If anything happens to Obed Morton, I will... Stop, please. You've got me all scared. Hello there, Sonic-chan. We are nearing Jemani's favorite room, the Bibu Bibu room. That is. This is probably one of the few rooms in the whole manor that is already has lights turned on. I still don't understand why a projector would hold three medkits, but okay. Hello there. 
Well, it's not a safe room per se, it's actually a puzzle room, so it's playing the puzzle room theme. And the Resident Evil vacant room alike theme. are downright impressive. Helene, can you forget your professor for five minutes and concentrate on getting out of here? If I were you, I'd try turning off the light. I noticed that light goes two ways on this island. Sometimes it reveals things, other times it hides them. Carnby, I simply hate riddles. Good, that wasn't one. He has the talking animation when she's listening, but that makes no sense. With all the head movement and hand gesturing. Is that how you listen? Happy. You can't scare me. I have lights. And we don't have to use this gun ever again, pretty much, almost. Carnby? Carnby, I have a gun. But Professor Morton... Professor? Professor! I don't think she gets the hint. Well, there were feet. You probably meant footstep sounds. That monster in the uh, smoking room or whatever it's called did have also footstep sounds. Curiously. I think those steps were muffled by the carpet. What a waste of good tomato sauce on the floor. 
Probably Alan's handiwork. Carnby? Carnby, I have almost captured the professor. Or is it the other way around? What are you doing here? I came to talk to you. I... Don't to shoot! I'm a human! You. Young lady, one doesn't come to Shadow Island to talk. Talking is useless here. At least you can't see her standing animation in this version. Carnby? Carnby, answer me! Aline, I thought you were dead. I thought so too. I'm not cut out for a place like this. I want all this to stop right now. I understand that. You understand? You understand? You don't understand a thing! I don't know what you, Johnson, or Professor Morton want with me, but all I want is for this nightmare to end right now. Look, get a grip on yourself. Where are you? In some room. Obed Morton drugged me and then locked me in here. And I tried to help him. Sounds like your wonderful professor might not be so wonderful after all. Don't move, I'm coming. Is that the best you can do? Yes, I am doing my best. Well, okay. Hurry up. How nice of him to leave uh, the revolver with her, at least. Just so you would ask, Sonic. the bedroom while I'm waiting for you. I'm sure I heard something, but... Aline, don't do anything stupid. Hey, you're not talking to a kid. And there's this mirror. A bit more reflection all round wouldn't hurt. Huh? Nothing. Now who's the dense one? Two times with two different experiences. Thought she heard someone's voice coming from this hole.
This game gave five medkits in a row, by the way. Without any enemies. Well, is that you? Don't overdo it. Did you receive the documents? Stop it. You sound like Alan. You have no idea what is going on here. Two agents will never stand a chance. What we need is the entire army. You're a downright bastard. Come get me out of here right now. Lamb? Lamb! No. No. Don't do it. Let me explain. Looks like art of the ear of the professor is was on his uh, neck, I think, by the looks of it. Second question is why did a uh, why do Alan and Obed wear the same bathrobe? Carnby? Did I miss the window? Looks like I did. Carnby? Maybe there wasn't a window. Well, whatever. Aline's jump scare sounds are very different from Carnby's. And this place is very dark on a CRT. So the screen shake kind of makes it spooky. going to tell me what's going on I still don't know here I got your stuff thanks I never should have agreed to let you come along I have my own reasons for being here this combi's model is lower res now? than his player model no were you I'm not sure anymore I have this feeling there's more than one Obed Morton PSX D may can beget it's too dangerous we have to find a safe place for you, somewhere you can hide and wait for me. Listen, Carnby, you and I both know the safest place is two hours away by plane. I haven't managed too bad up to now, and I'm not planning on just sitting around doing nothing with the little time I have left to live. I want to know. Just before, I heard a voice up above. There's a trap door. With your help, I can reach it. Why not stick together, the two of us? We both don't have the same goals. Remember what you told me in the plane? Come on, give me a hand. And if I say no? That's not your style. After all, he majored in smashing. They're using an even lower LOD texture for him in this scene unusual holy shit who'd have ever believed my fate could be in the hands of a woman you found out how to speak to the mirrors i know what you are seeking and i can help you find it we all need to know where we come from. We all need to know where the blood racing through our veins comes from. So I, Judas de Santo, I shall strike a deal with you. Edenshaw, the old witch doctor, stole my mirror. Should you bring it back to me, 
I shall raise the veil that hides your past from you. I know I can trust you. Go. Was it progressive metal poisoning? Let's see how difficult is it gonna be to access this switch. Actually less difficult than on the PC version. Or the DC version, should I say, since the DC version is the basis for all other ports. Carnby? Have a good rest then, TLH. Do what now? Call him? Carnby? Oh. To see if the button works from that place? Like this? No, it doesn't. You have to be behind the chair. Fortunately. It was almost impossible to walk behind the chair for some reason. Barry, help me, please. The door won't open. Quack. You met the ghost behind the mirror. How do you know? All those who make it to this accursed island meet him. Beware of his promises. Who is he? An evil being, a shadow fiend, a corrupter. He has great powers, but chooses to use them for evil. What about Obed? Something strange. I saw him, yet I'm not sure. Do not waste any time. Just tell him that I bear him no grudge and that I need to see him. Hello there, Ire. It's nice to see you. Managed to be pretty much still the beginning of the game. John Mira. Carnby? Let's see about that audio bubble distance for Aline here. Aline? Aline? 
Oh, you can already hear it, actually. In the Dreamcast version, not so much. So they probably broke the volume cutoff. And uh, this theme is not clipping and popping all the time. Here's your very pixelated smartphone. Actually, maybe just an iPad. Tablet? Well, you can almost make out the portraits at this resolution, but not as fancy as the 480p. Wait, wait, wait. Hope it's not Combi's blood. B is not as smart in terms of aiming upwards, but you actually could. This uh, puddle is never explained, of course. doesn't get as loud though as on the Dreamcast version. Well, I'm sure it's gonna get louder here. Totally ca can clip through her again. If I had to imagine they made separate samples of Combi's voice here. Rather than using PlayStation's uh, pitching capabilities, at least I think there were some. I knew I could 
trust you. Come, come, have no fear. Do as Alice did, come to me. Everything is so much more beautiful on the other side of the looking glass. Come, come now. Well, his Yelp reviews are five stars, so he must be very trustworthy. Give me the mirror. Fulfill our agreement. Can you easily do it on uh, PlayStation? Without actually changing the asset. Well, people asked for this, I suppose. Something like that. Carnby, you're going to be proud of me. I already am proud of you. I managed to defeat Deserto's ghost, and he had a statue. So our mission is nearly over. Are you sure of that? No, I only said it to bolster our courage. Hmm. Well, this is pretty much the only choice in the whole game, I guess. That can lead to a game over. Now I am Jessica Mirror. Carnby? I'm just a flashlight. I'm not very excited about the possibility of being able to traverse through mirrors, though. Let me congratulate you, young woman, for I admire your courage. What happened to the front but of your shirt? Who are you? They call me Edenshaw. Not Deep Throat? Finally, I meet you. Maybe you can explain everything. I want to talk with Obed Morton. Before you try and talk to him, you should go to his office. You will find out a lot more there. But what happened to him? Did they mirror his pants? Time is running short. I, who am the last witch doctor, I ask for your help. My forefathers showed me the Abkhanis ritual that can destroy the heart of darkness. I must carry it out tonight, or else it will be too late for the human race. We must stop the shadows before they spread across our world. But what can I do? We must find the seven statues of our seven gods of light. Only then can I carry out the ritual. 
Only then can I become the one the white men stopped me from becoming. The last of the warriors of light. I promise to help you. But how am I going to recognize them? Each of the seven gods has a holy animal companion. The statues represent these companions. But... Eden Shaw? Eden Shaw? Carnby, I talked with Eden Shaw. I'm sure he's Abkhani's. Good for him. Eden Shaw is an Abkhani's Indian. Carnby, Abkhani's Indians disappeared in the early 1800s. I confess I never really realized that. Okay, let's skip that part. Anyhow, he needs seven statues to carry out a ritual. Did he tell you that? No, he told me he was fresh out of strawberry sherbet. Carnby, of course he told me that. If I understand correctly, the statues depict animals. So they shouldn't be too hard to recognize. As soon as I find one, I'll radio you back. Oh, it's automatically open, huh? No need to unlock it then. Blood puddle is gone. All these medkits probably for those that accidentally run into the zombo ambushes. Cause those are nasty. No way to really predict them unless you already know they're gonna be there. Well, good thing you don't have dust allergy. Excellent pathfinding. And pick it up from this side. No beef for us. Wow. 
angry cat noises. Don't think I'll be able to run past these two. Carnby, I'm in Obed's office. There's a strange mirror. I'm sure it might be some kind of hidden passageway. Have you tried locating a loose piece or pushing it? None of that works. Then you'll have to shatter it. Again? Great. Seven more years of bad luck coming my way. Aline. Shattered memories. Come in. Stay there. I think in the Dreamcast version, those zombos went out of the uh, non-grabbing state faster than I would have hoped. In this version, they would actually work as intended. Kinda looks unamused, just a little bit. Carnby? I'm sorry I broke your jump scare twice. Unfortunately, I think so. I don't know what's going on. Does Obed have enemies? What has he done that everyone hates him so? And why didn't you tell me that you had another son? Alan? Alan? That horrid beast is my son no longer. We have very little hope left. Our family bears a dark secret, young lady, and Alan is the cause of it. Obed gave me this here. I know too well what it is. Oh, poor Howard. What have I done to deserve this hell? You must ask yourself the very same question, young lady. You did not end up here by chance. If the Lord allows you to escape, shed some light on your own life. You were born out of a misdeed, and you are paying for that sin. What are you talking about? <laughs> you know. 
know better than I do. Enough! Leave me now! I'm weary and wish to sleep. Besides, all in all, I find you very unpleasant. The main hall theme is still playing in the background here, and I'm sure you've noticed already, aside from the moving head and all, uh, when the camera cuts to Aline, she's actually frame frozen and not breathing. Is it because the dialogue is breathtaking? Carnby? If it comes to things that are disgusting, well, here's a sample. Why did you try and stop me in my path, father? You mustn't struggle against your fate. But you won't have died in vain. Your body is about to experience a new birth. The darkness blending into your blood will make you a stronger being. You will be faster. You will be a complete being. Oh, marvelously complete. First injection. Farewell, father. Second injection. Welcome, new man. Huh. Must be a surveillance camera. But my question is, how did Alan record that thing on a piece of, well, crystal or a glass? And how does it display it? And how does it display or play back sound? They're everywhere. Carnby? Is there anything in the puzzle room? That from Zombos, that is. Place where Aline took a nap.
Yeah, she doesn't really get anything here. Unlike Conby. This is basically wasting your resources in terms of shotgun shells. Oh, hi. Completely ignoring light. I didn't think this through much. On her side, there's basically a bunch of empty rooms with no porpoise them in them at all. Carnby? So if you're playing as Aline, There was no door sound, by the way. I could do a trick, I think. Oh, there we go. Bye, Felicia. This is the most common reason why people run out of ammo on her side for the first playthrough. Trying to actually explore. Carnby? Yes, Aline. I'm in the library. I'm sure it didn't reveal all its secrets, but... That's for sure. You'll never have enough time to read all the books in there. That's not what I meant. I recovered some sort of engraved metal cube. There might be a link. Well, then trust your intuition. And I'm pretty sure Sonic didn't see this part last time. It's a serious library when you have a box of grenades in it. Well, in terms of continuation... I think Con Bees is better made. But Aline's side does have interesting elements as well. Like the fort. Problem is, for example, when you're chasing Alan, all the doors are locked. But once that sequence is over, all the doors are open, but the game doesn't really tell you that. It's by pure trial and error you find out. That, oh, you can actually go through those doors. Well, I suppose you could explain it by the fact that maybe Alan opened all those doors, or Obed, or something. Because Carnby still wasn't around at that point. As soon as he enters the manor, he immediately goes to save her, rather than opening all the doors. In fact, the game gatekeeps you in that regard. Two themes still playing on top of each other, by the way.
Or grenades. Carnby? But the self-destruct sequence has not been activated, Sonic. Unlock all routes for evacuation. Not a very good use of space, I would say. I'm gonna hit the lever. His female sense was tingling. I wish she had Armenian backdash. Because once he goes into attack mode, he's invulnerable. And he peed blood a little. I need you one last time. I knew you would be back. Were you able to speak with Obed? Not yet, but I know now that he's alive for sure. I've got to tell you, your sons are monsters. Oh no. The true monster is this island. You must know, young Tonight is a special night. As for me, I shall let myself be carried away. I shall let myself slip away. I, yeah, it I played back a few frames. To rest now. Save your soul. I'm gonna try and save my body first. But I can't find a way out of this place. 
I only have one half of the medallion. I know not how you came about it, and do not wish to know. Here's the other half. May I ask you one last thing? Go ahead. Your son, Obed. Did he ever talk to you about... I mean, did he ever tell you he had a child? A daughter? Obed, a child? But with, with whom? Obed was never interested in anything apart from his accursed Indians. Obed burned his life away in the flames of a pernicious passion, and yet, how could it have been otherwise? But why such a question? For no reason. No reason at all. Don't worry. I'll bring him back to you. Don't worry. No, you shall do no such thing. I am to die, and you are to live. Such are our fates, opposite, yet intertwined. Now go in peace. I am about to enter the realm of darkness, where Howard will come and meet me as soon as you set him free. Thank you, young lady. Carnby, I can't see how to get out of here. Out of where? This manor, of course. I came in through a secret passageway that opened into the lobby. Carnby, how will I ever thank you? <laughs> no need to exaggerate. Once we're out of here, you'll forget I even exist. Please, Carnby, cut out the false modesty. Wouldn't that add some comedy value? Dark works be like, ah yes, well we had some inspiration from the tyrant. Didn't the first Outlast have, like, outright full frontal nudity? Oh, then the chances are very slim. Yeah, I think you... Oh, now you can.
Unfortunately, since not a smashing specialist, she cannot break that stupid statue. I know you have a statue. Blam! Still six missing. Bam! I don't understand why you never did something before. You could have prevented this whole nightmare. I am but a man. You have no idea what this ritual is for me. But time is running short. I know Alan is getting ready to open the gate, and that will unleash a true flood. You know I want to help. If I'm going to die, let's at least make it worthwhile. So give me a hint before you vanish again. Go to the fort. That is the Morton's true place. That is where you shall unveil the secrets of the island. Good morning! Maybe you need some breakfast? Yeah, pretty much non-player models in this game get severely dumbed down. Who's spreading fake news that there's going to be a CR for this? Like I said, Eden Shaw is very, very low res. Uh, Alan later on in the ending scenes is super mega low res. Even Carnby here, when together with her in a cutscene, was much lower. Well, not much lower res, but significantly lower res than his actual player model. Stupid And when are you gonna return? You're gonna miss out on the juiciest parts now. Carnby? Something's wrong in this background.
I like how it's not switching back to the non-combat theme. Listen, I can't hold up anymore. There's this monster chasing me. My my weapons don't even harm it. Maybe you should try a very powerful light source. But it's not like all the others. It's human, too. Aline, I found out that Alan undertook experiments on dead human bodies. Experiments dealing with the blending of creatures of darkness. The results aren't a pretty sight. Oh, man. We really gotta get some help. The only people who know that we're here are those who do not want to let it be known. I think we'll have to depend on ourselves, and only ourselves. It seems so hopeless. Well, we can skip the final boss battle, too. Condi? Not that you should. At least he's not clipping through the floor anymore. Probably all the segments that involve uh, extreme doses of battle music. So for example, the beginning of Carnby, Carnby's leaving the manor, uh, this section... I guess I could use this. Crown B side is a little bit more fleshed out, considering the development hell of this uh, game. Unlike in the Dreamcast version, there isn't an item here. Or is there? That doesn't look like it's glowing. Karma savings that she couldn't even pick up. I think the problem with Aline is not the puzzles, actually. It's the fact how uh, the manor plays out. Never played the game, then it's pretty realistic to run out of ammo while exploring the first time. Because of heavily respawning monsters. Very limited ammo. The game does tell you where to go, but it doesn't really tell you that, hey... 
This is the room where you need to be. Hello there, trouble. I think uh, the main difficulty spike in Aline's puzzles is probably making the perforator. Other than that, her puzzles are pretty fair in comparison. Speaking of trouble... Yes, Con B's ammo balancing is far friendlier towards the player. But as you leave the manor for both, it kind of becomes easy and irrelevant. Especially like mentioned, you can simply outrun Howard, but I find that boring. I mean, dramatic, yes, maybe, but less satisfying. Like people mentioning the whole stalkers in recent Resident Evil games, how it's kind of pointless to shoot them. And they're kind of annoying. Well, in case of Howard, you the game gives you exactly the resources to fight back if you choose to do so. There's not really much else to put those resources in something else. Because later in the game you get the light gun anyway. The zappy gun. This grenade launcher will be relevant at that point. This version, by the way, they have a mishap that the flare gun uses the same model as the grenade launcher here on the floor. Yes, you missed the Aline is getting drugged to sleep scene. How's it going, though? How are your levels of hunger? Coincidentally, the game doesn't really mention what the symbol of light is. Uh, it's kind of the same here, except not foggy, just very rainy. Finally, that moment when actually too hot to sleep. When you need to take out the proper blankets.
uh, Conby beats up Alan, like, uh, I guess, uh, Leon in RE4 did with that, uh, no wait, it wasn't Leon, it was actually Ada that uh, beat up uh, that uh, Las Plagas that wore his jacket. Oh well. Anyway, beats him up, gets it back. This puzzle was very problematic also. You can roll with my theory if you want. Feel free not to roll either. Don't. Arby, can you give me disc number two? Well, let's see. Checked. Alright, there's doggos. How did she miss point blank? Miss, please. Carnby? It can't be. Actually, this might be the Elden Ring. Looks very old and it rings when you touch it. This would be probably the equivalent of a Resident Evil uh, remake of the first game going up to the Lisa Shack kind of woods. Spooky Dark. Mario Wesker calling it to tell you that the monster in the shackles cannot be hurt. I mean, yeah, that's one way how to do it, and it should work. If it still stretches with those commands, cause it shouldn't stretch, but it has no concept of aspect ratio, you can add a custom resolution through your either NVIDIA or AMD graphics control panel. For example, 1440p by 1080p. That would work. You would also have to set that uh, the GPU respects the aspect ratio and doesn't stretch that resolution across of, um, across your monitor. Carnby? Carnby, I'm at the bridge. There's a lot of water in here.
And the weird cutscene. Carnby? Mm, but I guess that's water under the bridge now. Welcome to the Sands Fortress. A lot of puzzles and difficulties await. There's also the moon. Carnby, I can't get in. Carnby? Can you help me? You have around 20 seconds to put in uh, a snakey to reference in the chat. Imagine dragons. Imagine doing this while climbing. Welcome back, Sonic Chan. You missed everything again. At the same spot, more or less, at the same time. What a monster. I can't believe. You say wine? Where are you? I'm in the gardens. I have to locate Alan's lab. I can't help you. I'm up at the fort. But why did you go out so far? You're the one who didn't want us to remain together. I know, I know. I sometimes make mistakes. Sometimes? Oh, yeah. come on. Don't rub it in. Carnby? My, aren't we getting cocky. Let's see, one, uh, two, three, four kind of references, I would say. What's the point of a fort if the middle of it is completely empty and there's nothing in it?
And Aline doesn't like cats. Can these aberration even exist? Answered no. Carnby. In need of help again, Aline? Yeah. Don't try and be smart. I might not be a professional, but there's a chest locked with a chain. You're more of a professional than hundreds of detectives I know. I'd say that nothing's better than a pair of bolt cutters. And just where do I find them? Carnby? Carnby? Why is my flashlight not working? Where do you think you're looking? Maybe calling him Eddie doesn't have the same ring. Obed Morton up at the fort? Yes, I'm positive, but I don't know if he's still around. I'm practically more afraid of speaking to him than of the monsters on the island. I understand. But, after all, that's what I came here for. I was about to say that. Aline, don't get your hopes too high. I've grown out of having high hopes. Carnby? Things. Things happened. Thank God. Another human I being. I you've come for me. You can tell them that the writing tablets are of no use now. Alan already knows the translation, and thus has all the cards in hand. The gate is about to open, and the darkness to pour over the earth. The creatures will indulge in massacres that even all the armies of the world could never stop. Nothing can save us from the darkness now. You too should prepare to die. Why would you two die? Cold hand into my brain. Stop! Stop! I only want to find out if you knew Mary Cedric. 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 The name reminds me of a long gone past. But I want nothing to do with memories. I must stop it. I must stop it from getting to my eyes. Mary Cedric. Mary. <sighs> my blood is curdling. I feel my bones snapping like a block of ice in my chest. Are you sure you never knew Mary Cedric? Are you sure you're not my father? Me, your father, <laughs> me, a daughter. I don't know who put that foolish idea in your mind, but let me tell you that is simply impossible. So now, let me gather myself. I wish to ready myself for the judgment. When one bears the supreme sin as I do, 
One must get ready before the darkness. But I can see. But can he fight? Eighty percent of his speech was just pointless drivel of self pity. Carnby? Carnby? I just got disappointed. That. Guess I need to check the perforator first before calling. Oh, now there's three of them? Why not? Well, in her charm of savings distribution is kind of more uneven, if I may say so. But our puzzle solution. I believe I found out how we can reach the Abkhani's gate. I think I did too. Wait, wait, the tunnel is walled off. So first I have to blow this obstacle up. And to do so, I have to rebuild some sort of perforating machine. I found a text by Jeremy Morton about it, but the barrel, I have the feeling it's badly damaged. Maybe there's a spare one, or else some way to build another one. Okay, let me go look. Even if I manage to do so, I still have to locate an energy source. Doesn't Jeremy's text say anything about that? Oh, it does. Wait. He talks about using lightning. Well, it seems you're going to be having fun. But why did that tunnel have to be blocked off? In Alan's diary, I read that it was Howard, the twin's father, who walled it. Dead or alive, that guy can't stop getting in my way. I don't understand. I'll explain later. And she never did. Surprisingly, the model for this one was higher res on the ground. Maybe it's the fact that this room doesn't need two states with light and without one?
I think for now, yeah. Incorrect text. Carnby? Something about cars and bees. Now imagine her saying Edward every single time. An amazing chest ahead. If you don't shake them off in time, they do a pretty good amount of damage to you. Also, I found always found the jump scares pretty effective when first playing the game. And second time playing the game. Ca always c causes a good dose of anxiety. Even if you know that they're coming, it's kind of unpleasant. More like the surprise of them. Because there is no way to tell. Oh yeah. Hey look! The UV stretching is still here present. You can still see the abyss of grayness behind it. I've nearly managed to put Jeremy's perforator back together, but the barrel's missing. I don't understand. I need the perforator to get to the gate, but I read that this piece is very fragile. It often breaks and has to be cast in a single piece. So Jeremy must have set up a way to produce the pieces quickly. And you're going to tell me, seek and you will find. You took the words right out of my mouth. Oh yeah? Would you pick the PS1 classics? Oh. Oh. 
I suppose that answers my question. Here's the lower LOD first aid kit. S Need to show everyone how smart you are by streaming Kurushi. Or, uh, as it's known, it's known in US, uh, IQ, Intelligent Cube. That's a paid extra. But thank you for the compliment. Because you like Buzz Lightyear so much? Miss Cedric? Aline? Imagine every Stars member calling him Albert rather than Wesker. I suppose like Excella did. Then you play Mercenaries of Five and ask him for his Magnum. It must be... Japanese culture of... Uh Respecting older people, higher ranking people, I guess would be more correct. I've noticed that in uh, some other games that last names are used rather than first names. Oh wait, I didn't call him yet. Carnby. Aline, what's up? I found some kind of telescope. I'm sure it's important, but I can't get it to focus. There must be a corrector of some sort. A lens? For example. Again, you should know better than me, I suppose, Sonic. That's a hole. It's still there.
Everyone seems to have disappeared. So, should we do this the fast way or the slow way? The combat, that is. Since the slow way... We get to enjoy the soundtrack a little bit more. Oh, never mind. For self defense. Be my butt is freezing off. Yes, before the chat could answer, I had to use some force. Uh, was it Jeremy's place that mentioned the color coding? Valver? Nah. Oh, I'm out of grenades. Well, this is fine. This is fine. A pathfinding actually works. Hey, Jeremy, Jeremy Motono, give us. Must be a Jojo reference. Red. Done. Where? Where? I wish there was, but I guess he's too busy playing Day by Daylight. Day by Daylight? Yeah, I guess that's the right name. I'm not even gonna correct myself. Carnby? Upgrading our weapon! Flare gun looks uh, comically large, by the way, considering that it is a flare gun and not a rocket launcher.
Must be some industrial sized flares. Gotta turn. Was there some kind of multiplication on the PC version? Carnby, I have the four cards, but I don't know which order to insert them in. I'd be really surprised if Jeremy hadn't left instructions for his grandchildren. You should take another look at your notes. I'm sure. Thanks for the advice. I'll try. Let's see. So, moon. Then it was silver flash. Yeah, it's some silly balancing. In the original, you don't get that many. There is no multiplication on them. Sorry. Because right now I have nine and I have used zero of them so far. Well, make that ten. Open this. Aline, this is Carnby. Boy, am I happy to hear your voice. Where are you? I've reached the Circle of Stones. I know it's an Abkhanis cult place. I even know the steps to follow. You know, everything that happened to me since I nearly died while landing on the island, well... I feel like my entire vision of the world and life... All my ideas, my convictions... Everything shattered. Were you able to see Obed Morton? Yes. I think he's totally lost his mind. I get the feeling you never got an answer to your questions. Oh, I did. He can't be my father. But I suppose I already knew that. What got you thinking he was in the first place? Johnson did. He showed me a picture of Obed Morton and my mother. The dates coincided. I really wonder what he wanted by sending us out here. Anyhow, if he really wanted to get rid of us, he could have done a better job. I know better ways of doing that. Whatever, if we survive this, I'm telling you he's gonna have some explaining to do. But in the meantime, I have this incantation I need to recite, facing a specific direction. It seems the Stellas bear inscriptions, and according to the papers I was able to go over, there must be some sort of planetarium on the fort, something that has to do with the Circle of Stones. I think that's just where I am now. Well, perfect. Contact me as soon as you find something, okay? Okay. Over.
can't say this would help him much. Carnby, it's me. I think I found something for you. I discovered a series of Epconis symbols that correspond to various orientations, and I'm standing in front of a control board that must be what operates the planetarium. But I can only punch numbers in. Each of the stellas in this circle of stones indicates a cardinal point. Maybe your orientations have something to do with how the stellas are positioned. What's the first one? I think it's... north. Wait, there's an inscription at the top of the north stella. One mark. Okay, one mark. And on the southeast stella? Not so fast. Okay, I'm there. This stella has no inscription at all. I think I'm starting to understand. Go to the West Stella. West Stella? Three marks. Southwest Stella? Okay. One mark. There's more. Stay with me now. East Stella. East Stella. Two marks. What now? And if I said Northwest? I'd answer... I'd answer... nothing. Southeast Stella. Are you sure? I mean, I've already done that one. Just trust me. Okay, okay. Nothing, of course. And last of all, Southwest Stella. Southwest Stella, one mark. Perfect. I gotta think about this. I'll get back to you. Hey, hold on. I didn't do all this just so... So, Mr. Witch Doctor, how about that ritual? Okay, I know, I know. I'll trust you. Hello there, doggy. Once again, it's been a while. Carnby? Gonna input incorrect one, just for the cutscene. I'm a machine failed. How you've been, dog, eh? today's date into the planetarium control board. It's incredible. The planets are lining up towards the east. It's like you've been doing this all your life. I'll perform the ritual and then get back to you. Carnby, be careful. Now that's a luxury I think we can't afford. Over. Well, when it's... when there's doggy around, it's better than usual. Oh, Mr. Witch Doctor, how about that ritual?
Funny how they give you a key to a door immediately in this. Oh there, dithered moon. Carnby? that's about 10 inches wide? That's right. I need it. We absolutely have to meet right away. Okay, I'll head for the fort. You come towards me. Gotcha. Well, it's more like this was the reboot, and 2008 was more like an attempt to a sequel to the classics, as far as I recall. Since this one retells the story, once again, of Carnby. No, you can't pretend. You absolutely must buy a copy of Illumination. Hmm. Too bad the PC version's music is completely broken. Same as for PS2. And GOG never bothered to fix it. Well, technically you could just mute the audio, uh, the music, but... The game counts ambience as music, so the rain would be muted as well. Ow. No. I mean, they bare bones fix the compatibility, but they don't go out of their way to actually improve them like faulty ports for example at best they use community patches thank god another human being Oh. 
Well, the instruments are like just what 10 octaves below of what they should be. <laughs> I'm warning you, I won't hesitate to shoot. Aline? Aline? Carnby? Do I sense a regret? You scared the daylights out of me. Sorry. Do I detect a regret? Oh, it was Stop always him. detect because he's a detective. I have the impression <laughs> that all this is getting us nowhere. I found nothing but scraps of information, pieces of a puzzle that don't fit together. Like this seal. A seal? Show me. Not so fast. Do you have the stone disc? Ah, I appreciate your confidence. Sorry, but I've learned to Wait, be suspicious Wait, look at that Whether you like it or not, branch to partners. the right of him. Don't Is it like... Waste. Like okay, the, then, if talking the to fence is painted on? Like sprayed painted with greenery? That's not what I meant. But it is what you said. Here's the seal. Give me the stone disc. I need it. Why does it look like that? Glued to the fence, huh? Okay, but I want to tell you that I really admire your courage. Just and her courage? My courage? We'll see about the rest some other time. Go on, good luck. You too, Carnby. And Carnby is quite the egghead. With this uh, low LOD model. That's for certain. Carnby? He's almost a solid snake. Doesn't have eyes. I have this hole and I don't know what to do with it. Carnby, I have three statues. Me too. And I hope Edenshaw has the seventh one. We have to go meet him at the gate. I think everything's about to unfold right now. But how do I get there? According to Alan's diary, there's a passageway that starts in the fort. Carnby, you're so helpful that sometimes I have the feeling I couldn't do without you. Aline, let's stop wasting more time. You can also see the water waves the alphas, if I can even call them like that, going here through the ground. Is that some kind of uh, localization 
a very local one. I don't think the PS2 version had Polish voices, did it? I see. So that's where the budget went. So let's see. Combine the accelerator with the handle. Bind the handle together with the barrel holder. At least in this version, the inventory actually properly switches the focus of the item. Put the tripod to get the circle. Bind the circles together so you can bind them with the. Guess wrong order. Find the barrel with this thing. Find this together with. And you have a perforator that is working. No, that name doesn't ring any bells. So, considering the input latency and frame rate disadvantage of this version, I'll be able to do this within one attempt. Hit the lever! Koshmar, what? What happened to the third one? Oh, 
Oh, Ardini, you're so dummy. Man, you're clipping, son. It's funny how it stretches and then zip. Why am I alone? If this is a reboot, why does it come back? It never became the whole idea that it's a new one, a new nightmare, not a returning one. Well, technically this game was also released as a buggy mess. That's also a problem. Some inaccessible items, uh, some puzzles that can break the game unless you know very specific actions to do to fix them. A lot of clipping issues. This way, it's faster, by the way. Nope. Never was. There were also some compatibility issues with... Uh, the FMV is not playing back correctly.
Carnby. Aline, I'm in the undergrounds, moving towards the gate. I am too. Carnby, this is wonderful. This is an entire native culture that we believed gone forever. It's so rich. Aline, now's not really the time for that. But you don't realize what this means. The Apkani civilization ruled this part of the world for over 40 centuries. We're nothing but... We are nothing but a couple of humans trying to save their most precious belonging, their life. I know you're right, but understand how hard it is for me to accept that we discovered all this only to lose it right away. Clean, we're running out of time. I know, I know. Oh, that kind of D, huh? Carnby? The water is loud. And this time the screen shakes. Now it's Doze's turn to appear. Were you trying to draw some uh, game crashing symbols? reach the same point we don't have much time we gotta hurry or else our sacrifice will be useless now you're talking like a native I feel like I've been entrusted with a mission yeah welcome to the club there's a stella with some inscriptions over there I'd like to know what it says follow me what now so can you transcribe it is now before thee the gate that holds the darkness back in the folds of the earth thou who are about to open it thou must know that the night pushes the darkness back into these caves while the sun calls them out thus if the gate is opened Whilst the orb of day casts its first light, the darkness will spill out across the world, paving the way for its creatures, who will then roam the surface of the earth, feeding off the blood of all the children of light. That doesn't sound good. You can say that again. You say that that joke left you alone in the park? I think these must be the seven gods of light. Yeah, and that guy in the middle, that's gotta be Hecatum Curis, the god of gods. Hey, do you believe in that legend? Hey, do you believe in this island? Come on, 
Let's hurry up. How does he know that legend? Maybe if we show enough dithered backgrounds, it will stimulate those. Look at the dancing Alan. I'm begging you, Alan. You have no idea of the consequences of what you're about to do. Yeah, your horrible dancing is gonna upset the gods. Incho. For years now, you've been watching me, expecting this moment, just so you could see if your powers of witchcraft were still alive. But it's too late. You should have come begging long ago. You and I know that today is the day, or the night, <laughs> actually. You're shaking. Yet, you're like all the others, fascinated. I realize that only my father was able to fight the madness that courses through all of the Mortons. And that is what killed him. I am the one who killed him. And you want me to give up now? I spent my entire life waiting for this moment. I never cared for your human world. My research has paid off. I have created a new being. A being with no conscience, no feelings, no pain. A being who will know neither doubt nor hope. Soon, my children shall rule the earth. Ready to say Kiryu-chan. And my brother, that coward, will be one of them. I know what this statue represents, and that is why I am taking it with me. You thought that by destroying my world, you'd fulfill your destiny? Don't expect me to let you have that happy end. Get out of my way. There, he showed you some CQC. So much that Eden Shaw is now you, brown and he poop himself. Not what brought you here, but you too shall soon experience the taste of darkness and oblivion. Light has for too long ruled alone. It is time for darkness to spill out across the world. Bonadza Ternas Guru Helie Zair Hecatonkires. That she did. What a shame. He was a good man. What a rotten way to die. I am begging you, do not give up. If I do not recover the seventh statue, we are all doomed. But Carnby is dead. I'll never be able to make it on my own. Your friend is not dead. If he were dead, it would mean the gods of light have given up on us. And then we would have no choice but to kneel down and wait for the shadows. Believe me, Conby is not dead. I know what Alan wishes. He wants to make the seventh statue disappear in the depths of the shadows, thus preventing me from carrying out the ritual. 
You must stop him before the sun comes up and the shadows spill out. Do you realize what you're asking me? I came here to authenticate a translation and meet Obed Morton, and I end up risking my life every five seconds fighting terrifying creatures. Our fate is written, but we do not know how to read it. Learn to remember your dreams and make your mind up. You know very well that I can't say no. I've come too far already. Beyond the gate, you will have to survive. Remember that the waters of the springs you will find can cure you of all harm. But beware, they are few. Go now. Our world is in your hands. Carnby? Not sure how far back can you go. You can't go back all the way anyway. Where can't be left, I mean fell down. Rest in pieces. be on the right track. Where are you? On a rocky outcrop, above an abyss. You were lucky. Whatever happens, we've got to get Alan's statue back before sunrise. Eden Shaw told me that the waters of the springs had powers of healing. That's good news. I promise you, we're going to make it. Hmm. Hype for the next stream, huh? Well, for PlayStation 1, it probably would be Medal of Honor, for example. Tomorrow's stream is likely going to be Monster Hunter. Sunday's stream has a chance to be a PS1 stream. How many are you offering? Carnby? I was wondering if on your side you... The life I lead doesn't leave much time for relationships. But what is it that drives you so? For several hours now, we've been fighting powers that are beyond us. We've been pitted against a force that threatens to destroy our world. And yet you ask what drives me? But no one's forcing you to do this. You mean to say that I enjoy it? I guess you're right. You know, of course I would have preferred this to happen in other circumstances. But I'm still very happy to have met you. Had it been in other circumstances, you'd never have stooped to speaking to me. I appreciate your truthfulness. Eileen, 
can I ask this? Uh, is there someone significant in your life? Not really. Uh, or actually, several people would be more precise. Aha! I see. And what is it that you see? That you still haven't found your soulmate. Nice save, Mr. Carnby. Carnby? This is gonna be my doggo launcher. Excuse me, there's light. Why aren't you scared? Carnby? Tried to do some dubstep on me. It failed. That cave ceiling was extra dithered. Meanwhile, this is 100% not dithered. <laughs> Why? How could this happen? Why? Who made this? Is that Caves? Enrico's? Yeah. Yeah, we'll show you. Yeah, I tried to do that during, uh, first streams. Considering that this game has been streamed, uh, twice already, in a very short time, time frame, I do less of that during this stream. What kind of interactions uh, would you expect, though? Or Claire flirting? Well, I can't say that most of the radio dialogue in the original made any sense. It was mostly Leon saying, Wait, wait! Why doesn't 
anyone ever listen to me? Be it Ada or Claire. Certainly wouldn't hurt to have more interactions, but you also have to balance those out if there's too many cutscenes. Could hurt the replayability since you have to skip those every single time. Sonic is addicted, it seems. Oh yeah, here's the dithering. This would be RGB pixels almost. The R is not very pronounced, but it's there. Mostly G and B though. These stones are. I can clearly see dithering on this one. I mean, even here, for example, even if you shine the light on it, the dithering doesn't disappear even. Inconsistent. Uh, which one of these looks like a horse? Neko-chan. The PlayStation resolution preview icons really don't help. You can barely make out. You pretty much have to open and examine them. Uh, which one was it? I would, wasn't paying attention. Oh. How is this supposed to be? Oh, that's the fishy. You call this a bear? This an eggplant? Or are you happy to see me?
Game over. Carnby, there's a floor here and it moved. This is what happens when you don't have the Z. Why, yes, indeed. After all, the items picked up should always be sorted to be on top. Look at the sky, I mean, look at the cave of healing. Isn't it magnificent? Carnby, help me, please. Pyramid won't put itself into place. Quack. Flashbangs. My condolences to the thousand plus nits uh, screen owners. This HDR content is blinding. Here's the statue of your Upconus DJ. Lady Warrior, thou art valiant. I like it that the children of light be full of courage. Take this charm, for you have many more fights ahead of you, and I. Hecaton Kyrus, wish for you to be victorious. Where's my charm? Charm! Where is charm? Take this charm. What charm? Where a charm? I have been duped by a god. The universe. Or maybe the stupid statue that you see with the glowing eyes. It could be the Hecaton Kyrus statue. Down, boy. Gotta outrun the liquors. Or the cats. I guess they're cats.
Carnby? We're out. I have to check that with Sonic. Can I'm sure Wiki and or Moby Games should list all the releases and their covers, or at least most of them. Hello there, Safer. Out of rockets, but I'm not out of options. Ah, uh, this is the Not Bongo soundtrack. The very idle version of it. There it goes. This is the charm that he was talking about. What were you expecting? Trouble.
They didn't test too well the scenarios about how you can call in rooms where there are respawning enemies. I'm not sure if respawning is infinite though, but I wouldn't want to test either. No, she doesn't. That's disgusting. Still haven't finished it. Carnby, I saw Alan. I was unable to stop him. Aline, I do not want you to interfere. Alan is a very dangerous person. He will stop at nothing. I can't understand why he didn't kill me in the manor. He probably underestimated you. As you did. I gotta admit that your courage and tenacity are a surprise to me. If the future ever lets us, I hope you'll surprise me in other ways. And what would that mean? Oh, I'm sure you must have other qualities. Surely not those you'd expect of a woman. Carnby, I just spoke to Johnson. What a scumbag. I know, but he's our only chance of getting out alive. Still irrelevant lines because she hasn't spoken to him. He was looking at Alan with disgust. Same as an RE, you have to press action next to a ledge. No corn beef for us. There's pretty much no use for this item, that's for sure. Since you cannot interact with items uh, from the examination point like this, can't even open it. I don't recall which ones I've played. Hey. Okay. Did I play Sword 1 and 2? Been too long. Carnby? A pointless item. That's the point. If I had any time to spare, I'd congratulate you for your courage, but I'm running late. And it's also way too late for you, like ah, for the you're others. You're easy. Nothing can stop me now. Bet you can't see this and keep your Look. own. Look what you did to your brother. Oh, Ben? But. This dialogue never happens on Carnby's side, for example. Carnby! I did it! I've got it! 
is Quick, talking get back up here. to her All torch. I can't get back up. I have to find some other way. You go on. We'll meet up later. But I can't. I go. I'm ordering you. There were two charms of savings shown, but I only picked up one. I see. A flashlight with Wi-Fi capabilities. Ooh. The same bug is present, I think, here, though. Nice try for an ambush. Nice chair. Yeah, you did. Her initial frame of animation was incorrect. Now uh, for some Johnsons. No babies. Miss Cedric, this is Johnson. What? Johnson? How dare you? I just spoke to Carnby. You are such a scumbag! Making me think Obed Morton was my father! I had no other choice. Sam absolutely wanted you to go to Shadow Island. At first, I believed it concerned the tablets. But then I realized he only wanted to get rid of Carnby and you. Because you were the last two people who might get in his way. As for the translations, he'd have gotten them from Obed Morton anyhow. What about the picture? It was doctored. Damn! What kind of work do you really do? I work for the government. I was asked to infiltrate Lamb's organization. But it appears my cover was blown. And he sent his hitmen after me. You see, this is tough on all of us. I manipulated you, but was manipulated myself. All I can say is that I'm sorry. Now you will have to trust me. I'll try and get you out of there in an hour or two. In the meantime, hang in there. I don't need your help. Over. Carnby, I just spoke to Johnson. What a scumbag. I know, but he's our only chance of getting out alive. To have to rely on someone like him makes me sick. Unfortunately, we don't have the luxury of picking the one who'll save us. Do you think he might kill us? Well, you're right that we know too much to be left leading a normal life. What do you mean by that? That your life totally changed the very day you agreed to take this mission. I still don't know what you mean. I'm only saying that you have to get used to the idea of having to give up your current life. We're going to have to disappear, change names. I feel sorry for you. But what do I get out of that? A friend. Carnby? A friend. <laughs> What kind of ISO the Shutter Island is set? What's the focal length? I wonder what's that behind me? That it? Ooh.
Christ's sake, Johnson, if you're really with the government, warn your superiors, call in the army, do something. I can't. I've no authority anymore. Lamb burnt me. Carnby told me Lamb had the translation. I gather you know what that means. Yes, that he has the power of opening the gates of darkness. The gates of darkness. I discovered that Lamb has located two other gates. No, that's not possible. Tell me this isn't happening. The helicopter pilot tells me we'll reach you before sunrise. I'm begging you, don't give up on us now. I want to break your jaw so bad there's no way I'm giving up yet. Threats of violence. To answer that one, nah. You can see the other pair clipping through the masks, or lack thereof, you could... Lack of masks. Well, same can be said about that crystal too, I guess. Did I show how you can just outrun the boss? Carnby, I just spoke with Johnson. He told me there are other gates of darkness. Will this madness never end? A conspiracy like this can't be wrapped up so easily. The only question we can ask is to know if you're ready to keep on fighting. With you? Yes. Then I'm ready. He's full of determination. Baby gorilla? Stop! Don't listen to him! Shoot! Shoot! Oh my god! Daughter, would you dare shoot your own father? You're not my father! Nobody's my father! That's too close. <laughs> Looks like uh, not enough pushing yet. That enough? Yes, I outran him. Well, that's one of the ways. Run, run. I shall hold them back. But what about you? I am a 
Not close enough. All those infinite spawns caught up to me. Carnby? Are you saying that we have good personalities, trouble? Looking quite red there. Carnby? Is it? Technically, I think it might be taking even less shots than Alan. Now, that's your face when you realize that this, uh, Aline and the Darkstream combo of PlayStation and Dreamcast is finally over. There's the DJ. about to collapse run for it you put the wrong one in the wrong place baka carnby carnby I hope you break your stupid statue! Can't be help, I'm running through the exit, but it's not working. I saw a helicopter on the west shore. You haven't a second to waste. Hurry, because the sun will be rising soon. But, and you? I can now fulfill my destiny, thanks to you. I am most grateful. Now go. You can see his destiny in Tales of Destiny streams that I did. Come on, climb in. Time for Johnson's breaking jaw experience. Weedy, it's called fashion. Mr. Fishburne, you are a geologist specializing in what scientists call plate tectonics. Could you tell us more about what happened? Shadow Island was situated precisely on the crest of a minor fault line. This fault line suddenly spread by a dozen or so meters, and the island literally vanished. Miss Wallace, you can send Fishburne his nice little reward. The conspiracy doesn't end. This time we'll see the voice actors. I'm sure we will. The answer is no.
Thank you, and thank you, and thank you. When somewhere inside the light goes on And uh, for Sunday maybe Maybe there's a chance for Sunday Or PlayStation 1 stream Depends on laugh, I think That wouldn't be survival horror related. Alone in the dark. I was considering, uh, no, wrong screen again. I was considering maybe uh, something in the terms of Medal of Honor. For variety's sake, I feel like I could play that again. For Saturday, it probably would be Monster Hunter. Ah, yes, Johnson that is sitting all the time. Well then, uh, thanks for stopping by for the final Alone in the Dark stream. Yes, we'll see each other... There's something alone in the dark related in the future. And uh, bye bye for now then. Huh. Wishful thinking there, Sonic Chan. Well, we'll see. <laughs>